from the CBS Bay Area studios, this is KPIX 5 News. We're feeling optimistic. We're turning the corner. They're not going down easy, but we are getting them. Now at 6, it's the news people across the North Bay have been waiting to hear for a week. But it comes too late for thousands of families who lost their homes. The view from Sky Drone 5 shows the devastation from the wine country wildfires goes on and on and on. And good evening, I'm Juliette Goodrich. And I'm Brian Hackney. Firefighters may have turned the corner, but as you can see from Chopper 5, they are not out of the woods by any stretch. This was the view of huge flames and a lot of smoke rising from the Oakmont area of Sonoma County less than 60 minutes ago. The Oakmont fire first flared up in yesterday's winds. It's burning just east of Santa Rosa near Highway 12 so far. It has charred more than 500 acres. It is just 15% contained. Earlier today, we spotted this flare up near the St. Francis Winery in Santa Rosa. Because of the steep terrain, firefighters have been tackling the flames mostly from the air, but they've also been doing controlled burns to try to stop the fire from spreading south to nearby homes. In all, the wine country fires have left at least 40 people dead. But tonight, more of the missing have been found safe. That number now stands at 174. The fires have burned more than 217,000 acres since they broke out last Sunday night. And they've destroyed at least 5,700 structures. Cal Fire officials said today many people who were forced to evacuate will soon be able to go back home, but they'll have to be patient. Over the next 24 hours, 